Yeah. Can push out into the back. So a lot of changes through this week, signing with uh, Adidas. Uh, talk a little bit about that. Where are you going to be training and who's going to be coaching you going forward? Yeah, yeah. So basically, I'm just going to be training um, kind of near home in Marietta. Um, but yeah, I guess coaching situation is still trying to fully get that figured out, but I'll keep you guys updated in the future. What's the major uh, takeaway from your experience here? Um, you know, just it's hard, you know, like you come in here, obviously I came in with the fastest time, but you know, nothing's nothing's given to you. You know, you got to work up for every hard moment that comes, you know, it's like, yeah, you might come in seated number one, but it's anyone's race at the end of the day. So, you know, I just learned that, yeah, I can compete with these guys, but I still have a lot of work to do. It was a of the rounds again in the college season. Yeah, I mean, it's hard. I haven't really done anything like this. Obviously, you know, NCAAs is kind of similar, but I think um, three 800s over four days is probably about the same as doing two fours and two four by fours in three days. But yeah, it's, it's, definitely, it's definitely pretty difficult when you've already raced like 30 times. How is learning to race in a more physical race? I mean, that race itself that you were just in was one of the more physical 800s we've seen. How has that transition been since high school? Yeah, I think I think it's a lot different. You know, in high school, everyone's kind of smaller and they're not necessarily as physical, not necessarily able to keep up with you as much. So when you're in a race with a bunch of guys who got 143, 144, and you're all pushing and shoving, a lot of them are a lot more physically developed than me. So it's like, you know, it's just kind of hard, obviously, getting pushed around and shoved, but... I think, you know, it's kind of a learning process just learning how to deal with that and obviously, you know, I'll get bigger and stronger as I continue to develop. So, you know, it'll probably get a little bit easier as I go. Have you learned that you prefer leading versus not leading or in which situations have you made that decision to run one way versus the other? Yeah, I mean, I think I think I do like leading more, but I'm trying to learn how to race in any different situation. And I know I can race in any situation, but obviously, you know, there's a lot of learning that goes on behind it. I'm still very new to the 800, you know, this is my first season actually like devoting myself to the 800, so I think, you know, once I get more years of experience under my belt, I think, you know, my tactics will improve and, and I'll become more consistent. Was it an easy goal to 